you. Welcome back. We're at Exodus chapter 19, verses 14 to 17 today. They're getting ready to go up on the mountain. Let's read those three or four verses. So Moses went down from the mountain to the people and consecrated the people, and they washed their garments. He said to the people, Be ready for the third day. Do not go near a woman. So it came about on the third day when it was morning that there were thunder and lightning flashes and a thick cloud upon the mountain and a very loud trumpet sound, so that all the people who were in the camp trembled. And Moses brought the people out of the camp to meet God, and they stood at the foot of the mountain. So here again, we have kind of a continuation from yesterday morning. Lots of intensity. The people are ready to roll. There they are. Uh, and Moses brings them out. They follow through. They wash their clothes a certain way. They did everything careful to be consecrated. And now Moses brings them out, and they are gathering there at the foot of the mountain. Now, we can't tell from the text. Uh, did they completely surround the mountain? Uh, were they uh, down on one side of the mountain? And in fact, the fact is today we're not quite sure uh, which mountain it was. There's a mountain in Egypt called Jebel Musa, uh, which is called the Mountain of Moses. And there's a big tourist industry there. People go there and stay there and take a hike up, up the mountain, which apparently is Mount Sinai. But it might not be. It's possible that's one of these mountains about uh, 30 miles further to the south. Um, I won't try to explain that here today, but it could be somewhere else. Um, Mount Sinai, and you know, it's not really so important where it is to us. If God needed us to know, he would have, he would have made it very clear so that we would always know where it was. We could always go there and, and uh, buy trinkets there or whatever it is. But, you know, whenever there's an opportunity for God to set up, have the people set up a shrine, this is where the sanctuary was, this is where this was, this is where that was, you don't really see God doing that. You don't really see that God preserves a lot of things there. He wants to be careful that we don't start worshiping relics or anything like that. So, yeah, it'd be interesting to go over there someday and, and visit it. I've never had the privilege of going to uh, travel to Egypt, but uh, it would be interesting to look and see uh, what it's like. You can go on the internet and look at YouTube videos that are at Mount Sinai and St. Catherine's Monastery that's there and take a look around. So well, we don't know if that's it or not, but we know they were there and they gathered at the foot of the mountain, the people, and Moses goes up and down and we'll see what happens tomorrow morning.